All right, a question I've been receiving quite a bit lately is, do I feel that the Mortgage Debt Relief Act of 2007, which expires at the end of this year, 2012, will be extended? Now, very briefly to explain what that is, is that is a IRS provision that basically states if you're going to do a short sale, and this is your primary residence, and you have not pulled any money out above and beyond the original loan amount, that if you do a short sale, you will not have to pay any taxes. Now, in order for this to happen, your property also has to be sold by the end of this year, 2012. And in regards to my position, if this law will be extended, the, my answer is, I do not know. But I do look at some of the facts, which is this. One, we're seeing a hard time in government for any law or bill to be extended or passed. Next, and that's primarily based on the fact that we have different parties in each of the different houses. So as it stands right now, I don't know if anything's going to get passed. Now, if after the elections and everything lines up such that it's all one party one way or the other, it's possible. But who knows, it may take a long period of time for, it, for them to be able to get this through and extend it again. So what that means to you is this, if you are at all considering a short sale or, on, or are on the fence and are counting on the Mortgage Debt Relief Act of 2007 to provide a protection from you to not have to pay any taxes, I would advise getting started on the short sale quickly. Most people know that a short sale can take a, you know, a couple of months, if not you know, a year. So what that means as we're here at the beginning of 2012, that you want to get your property listed and sold before that time frame. I wouldn't risk it and wait too late in the game and try and, and hope that you can get a short sale done in a matter of two or three months and then lose that potential protection. Again, who knows what's going to happen after this year's time frame. And so, you know, it's something to consider. Uh, one thing that I always advise is to talk to your tax advisor to determine if you would be eligible for any of the other exemptions out there for not having to pay taxes after a short sale. And that way you know a little bit about uh, what your timing may be in this particular circumstance. So again, that's just my position on whether or not the uh, Mortgage Debt Relief Act of 2007 will be extended. Who knows, but to be safe, I would advise getting started on your process right away. Thank you very much. I'm Kurt Wanabo with ShortSaleInSanDiego.com and San Diego Real Estate Investments.